Today, I'm dressing... No! Do not try and be formal. Just talk to the cameras if you're talking to me. I got perfume. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome and welcome back to my channel. Today I have my boyfriend Sam here and that's because he acted as a stylist for today's video and styling me. I gave Sam two perfumes, one in a girly scent and one in a glam scent, two of my styles for him to use as inspo to style my hair, my makeup, and my outfits. So if you guys want to see how Sam did, then just keep on watching. Okay guys, first off, I'm going to tell you guys about these fragrances. This video is not sponsored, however, I got the opportunity to work with Dossier for the first time last month and I really, really loved their products and services. I have this box in front of me. This is what you were probably hearing me fumble with. I'm trying to make it presentable for you guys. Basically how their programming works is it's an online fragrance retailer and they're super awesome because their whole entire mission is to give you luxury inspired fragrances at an affordable cost. They want to be fair and transparent with the actual cost that scents cost in order for you to have a luxe experience without having to break the bank and so that you can try out new fragrances because it's always fun. So rather than spending hundreds of dollars on one bottle that's tiny of perfume, you can get the same type of scent way less money, like a fifth of the cost, okay? And once you get the fragrance, the actual like experience is awesome as well. Each fragrance comes in a nice branded box and inside you get a card referencing all of the notes, the inspo of your scent and the famous luxury or designer type of scent that this smells exactly like. They'll tell you the concentration of the fragrance and the best part is that in this box, you also get your full size fragrance. Boom, right here and you get a sample size so that you can try this out first that way since you're shopping online with fragrances and you can't really test online we don't have that technology yet you can order the fragrance test it out using the sample before you open the full size and if you don't like it you can just return it the returns are free no questions asked their products are vegan and cruelty free and each fragrance is made with clean ingredients i will leave more information and a link in the description box down below for you guys to check out but i think this is amazing i gave sam two different fragrances for him to style me as because you guys know especially if you follow me on instagram i have a girly glam aesthetic going on a little mixture a little bit of ball. So I wanted to pick two fragrances, one that I know that I would love and especially to make myself feel luxe in 2021, but also to fit those styles. So my first fragrance is called Gourmand White Flowers and it is inspired by Flower Bomb, a popular fragrance. And the second one is called Oriental Oak Moss, which is inspired by Chanel's Coco Mademoiselle. I personally have always loved this scent, so I was really happy to get these again with such a great brand and a great deal. So let's go first into the Gourmand White Flowers. This again is my girly scent. I figured that this would be a really easy choice um, because it kind of smells like to me like the stereotypical scent that you think of when you think of fragrances or like walking the mall or opening magazines. So I thought that this would be really good to pair with a nice girly daytime style for Sam. So let's see how he did. Right now we're doing the girly challenge. I mean, I don't know. I'm gonna smell the perfume and then I'm gonna match it to something. It says Gourmand White Flowers by Dossier. It smells like I'm walking at Macy's. So this is girly and I'm, I'm gonna supposed to match clothes. Is this expensive? I don't even know where to start. Okay. Flannel. Definitely. No. Alright, girly, I can do this. Ooh, okay. What's this? Breakfast club? This is girly, right? Are, are you supposed to have pants with this? No. This is a dress? Alright, this is a maybe. It's girly, so I gotta go pink. That's very gender normative, isn't it? Maybe I don't have to. What's this? This is girly. They don't have sleeves. A pocket that's too small for anything? That's a screaming girl to me. All right, a little accent piece. Ooh, does this go together? Are you supposed to wear something under this? Is this like an accent piece? What is this? Yo, why are all these see-through? I think I like the first thing I chose. 
That's girly. I'm second guessing the blue shirt or the jacket. I don't know what it is. Okay, why? Is this supposed to be for warmth? If it is, why is it only going halfway? Or it's a baby with long arms. Oh, we're going on the bougie. This is more glam though. I think I might just go with my gut. Girly. Alright, this is like cute, girly. I'm looking for a flat. I do not want to heel with this. This is not a heel. Yo, I need less choices. Oh, okay. Is she a ballerina? Uh-uh. Doesn't match. I'm gonna go with a flat white shoe. I don't want anything too extravagant. Ooh. Queen of England. Get a little rose gold ring. How much is too much jewelry? I don't wear any, so I don't know. Sure, let's do this on the other wrist. Oh, we got one wrist, and then the other wrist. That concludes you. Pink girly things, and girly girl. So, I'm gonna go to girly girl first. I see a lot of pink, so I'm thinking I did well. Um, not blue. Don't like that. Can I do girly hair? Um, none of this screams girly, girly hair style. Alright, okay. I think this is a little like Ariana Grande. We might return to that. I think it goes with the outfit. Okay, that updo or ponytail. See, waves again. I think I'm gonna have you do a uh, ponytail updo. Curly makeup. Pick a skin tone range. That one? I want something that's not too extra. Hey, simple. That seems... We'll return to this. That does seem too But then again, I don't know. Alright guys, so I'm over here looking like a little boy. It is time to film the first look that Sam completely chose without any of my help. And again, this look is inspired by the gourmand white flower scent by Dossier. So this is very much a girly vibe. And it is inspired by the flower bomb perfume. So now, let's get to the hair and makeup. I decided to do that first just in case I don't want to get any like stains on the clothes. So looking at the picture for the makeup that Sam chose, he actually told me to go between two pictures, both of which are very light and natural. So let's get to this makeup. Okay guys, so I finished the makeup look. It's pretty natural. I feel like I'm back in my like everyday makeup routine slash Sephora days. So next I'm gonna go to the hair, which of course he picked an Ari style pony and this has a whole bunch of fun little clips. So we are going to do that next. on the side of my head because that picture that girl had a whole bunch of clips but I think this is honestly kind of adorable it's kind of look I'm feeling it so now we're gonna change into the outfit and do a big reveal guys I love this look 
I love this so much actually. So again, I have my pony, my natural makeup, the jewelry, the bracelets, and the ring that he chose. And then the only thing that's a little awkward about this outfit, I had to add shorts underneath because this dress is actually completely see-through. Um, so I have the pink dress stacked on, the white shirt, and sneakers. I think this is so cute. Would I wear this? 100% absolutely. So now I'm just going to spray some of this perfume to really have the vibe going. And now we can show Sam his creation and take some photos. Okay. I had to add shorts because the dress was see-through. Yeah, it's girly, right? No, I love it. It sounds like you did a good job. Oh, okay guys, so he got through the girly style. So now for the glam. You guys know I love being extra even when there's nowhere to go. Okay, like I've been inside since March of 2020, but we're still doing it extra. If not, anything else we're being more extra now so i was super excited to try the oriental oak moss guys this smells amazing and let me also just put this in here these scents last on your body all day all right these are concentrated perfectly like they literally last as luxury fragrances and i said this in my last video i featured these in but honestly who's gonna know who's gonna know like that tiktok who's gonna know so i got oriental oak moss coco mademoiselle to assign to sam for the glam style so that it's more sophisticated and like a boss lady okay so let's see how we did with this one how what was it what's wrong i can't see your hand yet can't see your hand you're, you're holding the thing perfectly yeah, like I can see below, a little below. Ooh, Ooh. styling, Bobby right. Rossi. Today is Oriental Oak Moss. All right. I'm gonna end up just doing the same thing I did the other time and using it all. All right. Ooh, you wanna look like Chewbacca? Oh, look at see through. I don't have one more than that yet. Put you in oh, unfortunately, my Chi Chi's are a little too big for that, so I might have to sell it. I was very upset. Right, you try it. Uh oh, the video's taking a turn. <laughs> I'm gonna be the one. Oh god, oh god, you're gonna rip it. Your shoulders are too wide. Okay, Harry Styles. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna rip it if I put my arms fully through. So this is nice. How do I look? Beautiful. Alright, for glam. I don't know, for glam I see pink as well. I guess it's different from green. What is this? No, it's too churchy. Okay, businesswoman. Watch out. Ooh, okay, I like this. Ooh, okay, bedazzle. Ooh, Shania Twain. Oh, it buckles. Ooh. This is drapey. Oh, they got pants. I love that. Yo, I'm about to put you in this. And they got pockets? Oh, you set. I'm gonna put you in black shoes because I think anything else would be a fashion faux pas, right? Are these supposed to be like a flat top? Oh wait, I can go with one of these, can I? Ooh, okay, I might do some brown. Does that go together? This is more fancy, isn't it? Glam? I'm going to, you're gonna be dripping. Ooh, okay. Yeah, that's pretty glam. Sure, why not? All right, glam makeup. Oh, maybe a smoky eye, is that what it's called? A matte lipstick? Am I saying those words right? Sure. Um, okay, the cat eye. I'm looking up glam hair, ponytails, Ariana Grande's hot. A lot of ponytails. Look at those waves. Is that Vanessa Hutchins? Who? Vanessa Hutchins. <laughs> <laughs> and then blend here, I guess. With Kylie Jenner. All right, guys. So I am going to be updating the girly look I just did today. Originally, I was gonna film these on two different days, but life happened, so filming up on the same day. So I already have a base on, which is nice because I don't have to change much. He actually picked out four pictures for my glam look. 
Um, all of which have some like smokiness going on to the eye, but there's some that has like a little bit of a golden glow. So I think for the eyes, the main things I'm going to change is thickening up the eyeliner, adding some like a cut crease effect because they all have cut creases, and then probably adding on some lashes. As far as the face goes, that'll pretty much stay the same. I might add like a little bit of a more glittery highlight over top of the one I have. And then the lips, I think I'm just going to keep the same. It just has like nude glossy lips. So we're going to change the eyes for these looks so that we can look more like this. Come on. Rebecca, it's 2021 now, girl. Get it together. There she is. So we're going to this, okay? Let's see if I can do this as easily as possible while already having some makeup on my face. Rebecca, are you serious? I'm right here. Get it together, girl. So I updated the eyes, it was actually a lot quicker and a lot easier than I thought it was gonna be. I added my lashes, although this one wants to pop off. Girl, no. Do your job. Please and thank you. She's trying to clock out early. Girl, no. So I added my lashes, I added like a cut crease effect to the eyelids and some smokiness underneath to balance the eye out. And then I just added some highlight. So this is my glam face and now for the hair he chose this like wavy look um featuring Kylie Jenner so we're gonna go for like some glam wavy hair and then I'm gonna put on the outfit is nice long and wavy I think the jewelry pieces were perfect and then this jumpsuit is everything and then I have my little like elephants and I just think this is everything also sorry if my bra straps are showing I didn't wear the right bra for this but um I think she's cute she's glamorous and a little bit more sophisticated than the last look which is the point so now we are finishing this off with the oriental oak moss, which again is in the style of the Coco Mademoiselle scent. This is so good. I love this scent. It makes me feel fancy. And again, you can get designer fancy fragrances and look sophisticated whilst saving some money. So now let's see what Sam thinks. Ready? Okay, girl. Ooh. Oh, you're not even in the... Oh, oops. <laughs> <laughs> My bad. It's okay. I think you did a good job again. Ooh, yeah. Ooh. Start with the fashion. You should be a stylist. Again, I'm happy you didn't choose these shoes because that would have looked awful. Those uh, are two different styles completely. Those are like summer sandals. Yeah, I think you did great. Yeah. Chester, what do you think? Me too, man. Chester's the real fashionista here. Chi Chi. Chi Chi. Look. Hey. Say hi. <laughs> I think honestly Sam did a really good job. Um, I was surprised but not at the same time so kudos to him. I think I looked really good. I will say that my favorite one was the girly style like that. I lived for especially because I haven't worn that dress yet <laughs> so it was like brand new to me so I was feeling it you know. Let me know in the comments down below how you think he did and also make sure to check out the description box I'll have information about the brand so you guys can check it out but I'll also have more things little goodies little easter eggs in there so make sure to check it out and make sure you're subscribed if you have not already to stay tuned for more girly glam and slight ratchet content here online and with all that being said I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys!